Hello everyone and welcome back to the car mechanic world where I have some bad news to report. We've got my purple Lambo here. We've got our red Lambo here. We got our Evo here. We have nothing here. And I have no clue where they've gone. I think they've despawned. The engine is no longer here. I don't know where, but I'm going to try and park them and see if they're there. Nope. Yeah, so I don't know where they are. So I think we've just lost those cars. Uh, well, well, anyway, we're going to build a new car today. Um, so let's go to the barn. And um, I'm annoyed that we lost that Evo 6. Um, but just you know, doesn't matter. So um, hang on, let me just stop this camera angle out. It is awful. Yes, I'm very organised. Um, so basically, we're going to look for a skyline, skyline or something along the. I want something Japanese. Um. Don't know what I don't know what yet, but either like a Supra, uh, again an Evo Six, or like a, I wouldn't want like a Euro car, like a a nice Beamer would be quite nice. But we'll we'll see what we uh, what takes our fancy in this barn. Now when I go in the barns, my Xbox explodes. Oh, I I am yet to find one of these. So I'm gonna get one of these, even if that's not the car that we work on. Um, we got normal, normal stuff in the barn. Oh, we found the gold car. Let's go. And then it. That is sick. That's the car that Richard had in New Grand Tour, I think. The Oh, what's the name of it? What's the one starting with blue? Uh, oh, Buick. Buick, yeah, it's the Buick, isn't it? Right, we've got a Skyline and a Buick. Um, let's start work on the Skyline. Oh, just for how much hard work we put into that Evo. All the painting of the parts. I tell you what, I might not upload that video. Um, so it's going to make no sense. Basically, we did a video last time where we got an Evo and a Skyline and we uh, built a whole engine for it. We took away all the suspension for it and we're going to make one of the coolest cars. Um, and I've locked back on today and they're no longer here. So, we're just going to probably won't upload it and um, we're going to start off from here again. So, it's still cool. Um, I think we're going to build the Skyline first. Yeah, we'll go Skyline first. And, um, let's go for, I'll go for like a, a dream Skyline build. So I'll go for like a, like a normal base side blue, black wheels, and then we'll build on it from there. But again, come can it load in times, take forever. So, bear with me going. And then, I, f I keep forgetting about that Renault Clio. I, I haven't found that in a barn yet, so. That's another car that uh, I can build. Right. Okay, I don't know what's taking so long to load, but whatever. I think it's frozen, but I don't know. Oh, no, it isn't. Okay, good. Right. Where's the Skyline? The Skyline. Oh, yeah, it's already on the chops because it has only one wheel. Very nice. Where's the front lip line? It's pretty cool. Oh, look at this skyline. It is um, in a bit of a state. Uh, I'll say that. Look at it. You, you're probably going to catch a disease from looking at it. Well, it's time to restore this thing as well as we can. I'm sure we can make this thing a very, very nice car. And I'm sure we can uh, spin turbo drive this thing. I mean, I'm hoping anyway. Surely we can put on like a nice little turbo for it. I hope we can anyway. 
Um, parts are in not a bad condition actually. They uh, hold together quite well. So it wears only like fifty percent, which uh, definitely isn't bad for. I mean, the, for the car of this, you know, doesn't uh, look the best. Like somehow that was forty three percent. That was don't quite know how. But um, I do expect it for having to pay sixty thousand pounds for this dump. But I suppose yeah, it's a skyline, so you cost a bit more. But like sixty thousand. Right. Okay then. Right. Now on to our second suspension. Get it done. Right, disc ventilated, wheel hub cap, wheel hub bearing, and yep, yeah, it's going all right. Um, we have now nearly finished two whole suspension. Well, just two whole sets of suspension. Not bad. Um, then we got the cross member in the front to take off and the steering rack and that lot. But apart from that, it's uh, it's all right. I do lower suspension arm. Then we've got the exhaust and hopefully we can take the gearbox off. Uh, I don't know how that's in such good shape. This tie rod, that's something about 17, but like. Mm. That. Yeah. Steering rack, get that off. Yeah, that was 40%, that was. That was 57. Right. Time for rubber bushings. So many of these. And yep. And oh, hang on, yeah. We need this. Okay, now the game's frozen. Great. Uh, okay, it's, it's frozen again. Oh, God. We have a uh, real Xbox. Okay, it's frozen again. Okay, great. There we go. Front sway bar. That was 53%. Wow, that's pretty good. And now for the cross amber. Very nice. It's got a nice starter on it, always a good sign. New drive shaft. The red WD, sorry, I'm definitely not WD 40 on it. Um, to get this gearbox off, this is an awful gearbox. Okay, yeah, that was, oh my god, look at this thing. Right, to release bearing, to pressure play. WD 40. That's. A good clutch plate, yeah. That isn't so good of a flywheel. Uh, so the exhaust, catalytic converter, middle muffler, exhaust pipe. That's in good condition, yeah. Right, that's the whole front suspension done. Now for the rears, shouldn't uh, will probably be more complicated, but hopefully not too much. Okay, this is rotted away a bit more than. Um, yeah, this doesn't look so good. I was pleased with the condition of the front of the car. This doesn't look so good, but we'll give it a chance. It could, it could be amazing. I very much doubt that, but it definitely could be. No, 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 no. Oh, great, I had two years suspension arms, great. Um, get the shock absorber off. That's quite dirty, actually. Um, suspension arm. It's it's got a quick tear down we are doing on this thing. Very very complex. Get this down. Suspension arms off. Get for the sway bars in the wheel. Perfect. Get these. Get springs done. Shock absorber cap. Full active spring for it. Spring cap, get the suspension arm off. Time for the knuckle housing, is it? It's the knuckle housing. Small rubber bushings, we need those. Um, what do we got now? Fuel tank, uh, yeah, we can take that off. And now, for the last part of suspension. It's, it's pretty uh, repetitive, but you know. It will be worth it, hopefully, anyway. That's 14% for the brake caliper. Jeez. Uh, we're... We're... 
Uh, right, let's get the wheel hub bearings off. Wheel hub itself. That was a that's a good wheel hub. Okay, apparently it isn't a good wheel hub. Uh, also, for if anyone was wondering, um, the um, I'm gonna start doing Amazon again quite soon. I don't know when, but I will start in a second. But uh, like it probably be a few videos, but you know, I just personally prefer doing this, and I think it's a bit better. But you know, what do you guys prefer? Let me uh, let me know. Right, and sway bar rear end link, perfect. Sway suspension arm. Get that all greased up very nice, all unseized. Rear sway bar, rear suspension arm, and now for a knuckle housing. So, no, we need to take out the small wheel this one. Now, perfect. Full rushings. Get this. Get this. Oh, that sees right. That one looks good. That was twenty two percent. That's not bad. And that is the whole suspension of the car. Donezo. That's good. Uh, right. Over here, pass me a oil filter that looks in really good condition, mm, decent condition. Uh, right, that should be good. Uh, let's go get the engine train, move equipment, loop sand star line. Great name. Let's get the save again. We can just you know, just quickly. Um, let's open this. Yeah, right, give me this, pull out, perfect. Right now, what can we put in this one? We can either put in a straight six DRHC BU2 or that, but a turbo. We're going to do a turbo because, like, quick, quick, and like, don't, yeah, whatever. Uh, so straight six. Where are we? BU2 turbo. That's what we like. We like turbos. I'm not going to paint any parts, I don't think. I'm just going to try and build just a good engine, uh, no special um, visuals, should I say. Uh, just thought I probably should buy, yep, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. I don't know what I need. Before, okay, I'm going to brake calipers, I need four brake, brake caliper cylinders, and then we want some piston rings just little things that i remember that annoy me i uh i do it just um just in case right good wheel hub caps yeah wheel hub bearing four bows front wheel hub weight ventilated front axle knuckle cover what else we got sway bar yeah front shock absorber outer tie rods inner tie rods inner tie rods uh, low suspension arms, I probably have loads actually. Uh, yep, steering rack, of course. Front sway bar, only one of those. Drive shaft, that's probably the biggest part of it. Gearbox, no. Yes. It's only 1% extra horsepower, which it's actually quite disappointing. Right, here is where we have spicy things. Yes, perfect. That's a lot of horsepower. Middle muffler, exhaust pipe, yeah. And back to brakes. Brake disc, yeah, two of those. Rear drive axle. Here becomes the complicated part of the car. Uh, rear wheel hubs. Rear suspension arm. It says three, so I'll buy four just in case. Uh, a rear shock absorber. Uh, rear suspension arms, rear suspension upper arm, sway bar front end link, shock absorber caps, rear spring, lots and lots of stuff, but um, it's lucky that we're in 
sandbox mode for, otherwise we would be broke already. We were saying, but why did I buy one version? Rear sway bar, rear suspension cross end bar, oil filter, and engine block. And now we are on to engine parts. So yay, here becomes complexity. Uh, right, let's start the rebuild. New oil filter, yeah. Lots of stuff that we need. Fuel filter, okay, passing pump, perfect. Crankshaft, E. Alternator, yeah, we know we got that. Water pump, okay. It's going all right, it's going all right. Uh, water pump. Alternator, oh, we've got a new water pump pulley. Uh, crankshaft, which gives us weight for our pistons. So here becomes a lot of horsepower. Um, hang on, water pump pulley. One, two, three, four, five, six. It is a, yeah, it is a six cylinder, I think, anyway. Water pump pulley, perfect. We could just tilt the engine, but it doesn't matter. We are more about complexity. We may as well. Um, why have I zoomed in so much? I don't know. This is giving us a lot of horsepower. Um, yeah, this is going to be a pretty fast skyline. And I am not complaining. Right, new engine head, flywheel. Just about it. Oh no, we need a uh, need this. Bang! That's why you want to build your engine here. Just uh, literally because you can do that. Engine head. That's a lot of money. Flywheel. Yes. Rod caps. You can't. Rod caps. Um. Rod cap. I'm gonna. Yeah, I think it's six rod caps. And we'll buy six. I don't know. I can't remember how many crankshaft caps there are. It's probably going to be free, but I like, I don't know. So, I'm going to play it safe and buy six of each. World caps, a little revising, very good, very nice. No performance parts here, though, so no quicker than it needs to be pistons, but it's fine. It's still going to hopefully be a rocket ship. Uh... Now, nearly done with our, well, the underside of the engine. Um, I do hope this one doesn't crash. I don't quite know why. Maybe it saved, it said it saved, but it didn't save properly. But, I don't know. Go need a new oil pan. We can do that. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I know why. Because we already had all of these, didn't we? Yes, I remember. But we did need a clutch with least bearing. Oh, yeah, we still got one. Really nice. Uh, engine head. Time for speedy camshafts. Don't know why this engine isn't falling off, but whatever. But like, how is that fuel filter staying there? I'd like to just point out. Uh, right. Uh, camshaft. Intake manifold. Exhaust manifold. And probably the other can gears. Right, we never don't need those. Oil pan. And time for horsepower. Why are they not in that? Why are they not in that, but they are for every... Why does this car have nothing with performance? What? Why has it got barely anything for like performance modifications? That's annoying. Yep, turns it round, perfect. I really, really hope this car has some sport modifications. Why can't you put camp really fast? Okay. Okay, if you can't get a low edit version of that, there's something wrong with the game. Like, why, why are you not going to give me a 2000 horsepower Skyline? Please, I want that. Oh, spark plugs. Okay, if it doesn't give us spark plugs, then it, 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 it's, no. Um, K, 
Ja czeka. Co ja powiem ci odzie? Fajnie, Diodic gives a special one. Spark plugs. Six of these. Very nice. Cam gears and camshaft caps. Um, I'm going to guess you need 12. Because it's two cam gears, but it might be more. It's probably even more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, we're gonna buy an extra. We're gonna buy an extra six. Um, so you know, whatever. Right, now time for repetitiveness of doing camshaft caps. It is going to literally torture me doing this, but whatever. I was making very progress in my WWE though, because I was going in and out of the paint shop painting all the parts. Uh, remind me to never do that ever, ever again, please. It was painful. Um, we need to put in our spark plugs next, then our ignition coils, then all the electronics. So it, it was a while to go. Uh, and your head covers, yeah. So yeah, I think we can, we could probably try and do a bit of suspension in this video. Uh, I don't know if we'll be able to. Maybe we'll be able to. Can we finish the cast episode? Probably not, but whatever. We'll, we'll see if we can. But we can definitely finish the engine, I hope, anyway. And one more camshaft cap, and we are done. We're done. Right, time for the big meaty turbocharger. Oh! That is nice. I'll, okay. Engine is starting to look very, very, very nice. Right, cam gears, and here we go for a million different things to put on the car. Do we have one? Okay, of course we don't. Uh, right, time for the next money spending. Get rid of that. What? Right. Do we have? I'm guessing not. Yeah, no, we don't. Okay. Um, one of those. One of those. No. Uh, Serp time belt, very nice. We'll do the uh, timing before we do the stuff like that. I didn't want to do that, that, and that. Not that, not that, just that. And that will buy about, I don't know what I bought on Bowling in a single, but I am. Bought a few of these because I know that we're going to need some later on down the line. Mark my words, we're going to need some more rider rollers. Oh yeah, forgot. Uh, timing cover, very nice, very nice. Yes, crankshaft pulley and idle roller bay, I told you. Crankshaft pulley. Why have I got crankshaft pulley for straight four? Why is not going for a straight six? Mm. Why are we not buying them for straight sixes? Not, what, not, we don't buy straight four stuff here. We buy straight sixes. Uh, yeah. Radiator fan and belt tensioner. Here's a million bolts. I oh, know it isn't. I oh, know it is. It is a really big bolt. And I think that is just done. That's one more section of it. No. Well, how are we looking this side? Yeah, it's going all right, you know. We do this, then we do. This side, and we're going to go spark plugs, then ignition coils, then we should be done. Okay, hang on. Let me quickly save the game. Because it's freezing, and I don't want to be freezing and it crashes. I can say that now. I don't know, this is the last thing I'm going to actually put on the car. Oh, wow, okay. Uh, yeah, very big ignition coils. Oh, hang on, no, we need a fuel ray, don't we? Yes. And I don't know. I don't know where our ignition distributor is, but we'll probably need it down the line. Uh, fuel oil. Are we gonna need any mini fuel oils? Yeah. We can't just have one big fuel oil, can we? No. Oh, surely we have a. Um... Yeah. You can call you, yeah, what? No, don't buy one. Buy five. Uh, right, put the fuel rail on. 
And then this one for yours. That looks pretty sick. I like that. And last one. Coils colour, coils colour, coils cover, and I think we are, we are done. We are finished, look at that. We finished our Skyline engine, our not so much RB26. Wow. I mean, it isn't really... I mean, it kind of looks like an RB twenty six, but yeah, yeah. Uh, right, go round and mark all these. Bang, 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 bang. Lots of fuses. Come on, keep it coming. Keep it coming. So many things that we still need to do to this car. That's probably the easiest part, well, the, the quickest part actually. And time for these bloody clips. But if you if you if you can't find if it says car can't start because of clips, it is either on your ignition distributor or your air filter. Okay. Please remember that, because I built like a Maserati Seabring, did it all, and then found out that it couldn't start, didn't know how to start it. Anyway, we've now, yep, that's 100% engine, so it's all built, and now, that is not fitting. That just does not fit with this car. Um, Alright, time for relays. We'll buy three of these, because I don't know how many you need. Fire rose. Fire rose. Now down to these small ones. One, two, three. One of those. One of those. Now down to the clips. One, two, three, four. Air filter cover. Air filter. Oh, no, 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 no. Why is. Forty, the um, air filter, air filter base, and electronics, ABS module, ABS pump. Right. What do we do now, then? Should we do or should we do next? We'll do. We'll do like the 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 mini stuff, shall we say? Okay. Yeah. This is yeah. We have a lot to go. A lot, a lot, a lot to go. Which I'm, yeah, looking forward to. What we could have done actually is bought all the all the special parts and then upgraded them even more. We could have done that, and I might do that for the Buick. Yeah, probably will actually. But then I'd have to manually take part of the engine. Ooh, we'll work it out somewhere along the lines. Okay, the game has frozen for longer than usual. I'm slightly worried. Okay, right, well, we're safe, we're safe. Um, I probably do need to upgrade this Xbox because it, it doesn't like, it doesn't like working a lot. Uh, fuse box. Now time for all of the electronics. The important stuff that will literally is the thing that makes your car run well, except the engine for the second most important thing to make your car run actually um so it, it's going all right actually relays in fuses done fuse type b lots of fuse type b's really purple ones the special purple ones is it coming up? It's the last one. Oh, so is that is purple? It's ninety. Oh, it's a hundred. Ooh. Oh, we don't have that. Does this count as? Oh, it does. Don't know why a cover count, but 
I think I'm fine. Uh, anyway, let's start with suspension, shall we? Let's raise this boy up. And um, let's. We've been going for half an hour, almost dead on. Um, so let's start with suspension. We'll probably do the front half of suspension and leave the rest for next time. Um, the skyline is definitely looking. This probably sells now for higher than it did, probably. Like, in. Although it doesn't have many parts, the condition of these parts are amazing. Like, completely brand new, off the shelf. Right. Time for the suspension cross end, but very nice. Lower suspension arm. Like, uh, how hardcore this game is, if you're. Rubber bushing. If you if you're missing your rubber bushing, your car won't start. Sounds stupid. Your car won't start if you're missing your rubber bushing, and the rubber bushing doesn't go in your engine. That's how dumb it is. Okay, bear that in mind. And that's rubber bushing perfect. Ah, do we need a? Yes, we do. Right. Front, front, what is it? Shock absorber A? Front shock absorber A, yes. Two of these. Two of these. Two of these. And let's go over to our spring puller. Perfect. Let's do this. And that's one pull. We'll do the second one. And the second one pulled. Perfect. Now, let's get back in the engine bay. We've got a new double wishbone shock absorber. What? Did it not work or something? Hang on, well, this, hang on, why did that not work? Also, it's, oh no, it's flat now. Sorry, does somebody know what's going on? Why can I not? So I pull this, that's fully pulled. Hang on, was I not doing the right ones? I might have been doing like front shock absorber of B. Okay, only one of them's works. Okay, I'm gonna say I was using the wrong shock absorber itself. But I don't okay, I'm what well, okay. At least it's now working. I say that. We don't even know if it will work for the next one. Uh right, what are we missing now? Right, okay, well we get on the yes. No, don't go here. Okay, put up. That's fine. Uh, rear sway bar. Rear sway bar. Front sway bar. Sliving rack on. Gearbox. We'll get that on. Starter. Have we got a starter? Okay, of course, uh, of course we'll have a starter motor. Yeah, that wasn't actually here in the first place. So, yeah. And... We're going to do the inner tie rods, outer tie rod, then the sway bar for an end link. And then that's where we're going to leave it for today. So this, and the last thing we do is this. Um, so that is where I'm going to end it for today. Um, if you did enjoy that video, please do like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.